Let me put a few hidden final touches, and then we should be good. So let's see, I also want to put a T-72 in here. Basically give air a target-rich environment, and then set up a few mobile patrols, that would be good. Sweet, alright. Running a bit behind because of uh, IRL stuff, and miscommunication, and... Ah, uh, the whole nine yards, you know, but what's up guys, Liru here. Don't mind me, I'm just finishing an operation and then I'll clear them on starting to move out. Okay. Blue 4, can you hear me on 55? Yes, I can. Alright, you guys are clear to move out for your operation. Roger that, thank you, I. UN, you can hear me? Hey, bro, we can hear you. All right, you're clear on your operation. Okay, so uh, I'm putting myself on a bit of a timer here. Um, what do I still want to do? What do I still want to do? Cut off. And I always like using uh, this building as a storage building because you can fit a bunch of stuff in it. So a few of those, uh, one of these, hippity hoppity, flip it around, and let's take uh, some of these. We're rushing it, but uh, I'll give, uh, you know, I'll give a few moments to let people, you know, jump in, check out what's going on, and then I'll uh, talk about what their so, objectives uh, are. So we on 55 then for long range? Yeah, A firm, you're uh, with me, you're on 55. UN, I cleared you to go. Yes, AO's ready. Go. You can hear me on this net, right, UN? A firm, we hear you on 50. Okay. Just making sure, because you just How asked me to. Up on 50? Yeah, he's not even on 50. Oh, motherfucker. Okay. Good check. Yo, you ready, Nero? Uh, I'm gonna kill you. Yeah, we're ready to move. Oh, yeah, let's go. Uh, move to the whole point one. One last command, I forgot. Ah, uh, ba 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 ba. Dev tools. A little rushed. Uh, and by the way, um,. We're not doing the kid all mission, not because it broke. Uh, something IRL came up that I got to take care of. So, uh, you know, it's just it's just how we got to roll. There we go. Cut grass. Save on some frames. AI won't be able to shoot through the damn grass as they're patrolling. Ya di da. We all win in the end. Hi, this is Blue Four. Send traffic, Blue Four. Roger, do we have any intel on who we are going to be uh, fighting these uh, in this angle? Roger, uh, check a D insurgents, uh, Soviet arms, uh, and equipment, as well as, uh, possibly mechanized motorized vehicles, uh, similar to the UN guys, except the UN are wearing all white and blue, so, uh, with some forest camo, so be advised on that. Roger, thank you. Okay, so that should be good, and they're doing a land convoy into this Sending AO. Goat all right, teams. cool. Uh, oh, well, yeah, Send traffic. Serial dead. Six months in a row for that sub, man. Oh, I appreciate it. I hope you keep enjoying the operations. Uh, and, uh, uh, yeah, man. This is High Command, Sun Traffic. Hope you keep enjoying the ops, man. Hope you, you know enjoy this one. Any info about the civilians' population? Roger. Uh, we expect that the civs have uh, fucked off from the area. Um, we got some initial reports. It's unlikely that there will be any left. However, we want to preserve uh, structure integrity. So, uh, when the stuff is said and done, uh, we don't have their houses blown up. Okay, avoid poverty damage. Of course. Alpha copies. Okay. So, let me explain the premise of the operations today. Uh, first and foremost, I'll just buy a switch beam here. Are we gonna pull over and let the other, uh, one of these UAVs take over? 
Hold on, let me refresh the page because it's still making yeah. me auto host the bill and to watch the stream like POV, the so nothing uh, forks. But anyway, Tier three's objective is simple. Um, they have to capture these two guys. Uh, this one right here and this one over here. Uh, these are the leadership of the uh, Chekadee insurgent groups that are moving this area. Uh, I have told the uh, Tier threes where they are. They're at these two uh, question marks. However, if you notice uh, right here, there's a set of a water and a food truck. The UN's objective is to check all five of these question marks uh, for a set of uh, water and food trucks. So, get back into Zeus. I provided them with a template over here of uh, what these will look like. So the food will be on the back of this truck, and this will be the water truck. And uh, we've got a set of the vehicles here in those two warehouses. Uh, here in that small warehouse and then within the blue four objective over here and uh, This is just to test the overlap. So blue four Should uh, be doing this objective. Confirm, does green four know we're here or are we supposed to kind of be a bit stealthy in regards to them? Uh, Roger uh, UN forces know you're operating in the area. However, they don't know how close uh, There is overlap in this operation. So uh, if you guys are too slow uh, there could potentially be blue on green. Got it, that's fine. Because, you know, these guys have to finish their first three before they get to the overlap, but they have to stealthily do these two. So, um, you know, it's interesting to have two forces operate in the AO. Hey, Moon, how you doing? But, uh, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll get into this and see how it all goes. Hey, For those of you making your first stream, AGA, welcome. Can you take point, please? I'll go just uh, no, DC. That's not a good I'm sign. Okay. But yeah, I gotta keep in mind that it looks like there's only uh, four of them operating within here, so... I don't have any armor for them to they fight. They might have one Dishka to deal with, they but... Um, point. Yeah, only one Dishka per spot. These are lighter objectives by their command because most of their force is over here. Let's also set our global skill. Uh, since this is going to be the framework for the new Tier 2 Ops, we're going to do our standard 90, 35, 50, 50. Uh, that seems to be a good balance of it. The player base is doing everything they're supposed to. They'll complete the objective. If they make too many, like, really stupid mistakes, they'll die. Here are the UN guys coming in. So, they're using this as a command vehicle, or at least I'm assuming. And then their main transport, uh, is with the BMP-2. And then, uh, you know, these two groups of forces over okay. here. I also don't see them having any pilots today. Huh. You know, that's weird, because we have, like, 30 people for the last week's op, and now we have only, like... Jeez, a small um, operating number today. I was expecting a bit more, but that's fine. Yeah, so blue four, we've only got a handful, and then, uh... BRDM at the end of the road. And it's not so much either. But hey, we'll just have to see how this all plays, you know? The UN looks like a bunch of African rebels. Yeah. It's, uh, I'm using the SAF uh, forces here. They're lining up their shots. What I like about this, uh, these types of operations, though, is we have a very uh, large AO that I have to manage two player bases that could potentially shoot each other. And also, now that they know what this guy looks like, I will delete him. And they know what this looks like, we can delete that. Alright, so they decrewed that vehicle piece. There that goes. I've got a squad over here. I'm going to have React. Going to pull that MBT out. Set her to seek and destroy right here. Ah! Mulligan. So I'm going to uh, AI on Garrison. What is wrong with you in trying to run these people over? 
Oh, that's just some garrison the entire group. Oh, wow. Well, this is interesting. I thought I ungrouped those guys in time, but I did not. So we're going to have some movement within this area, uh, and then they'll push against. First, they'll rally. Hopefully, they're poking through to see that I'm reacting accordingly. I got this tank that's pushed up. Metis launcher missed. Tank is now reacting. It's putting its barrel that way. And she's also going mobile here. So I'm trying to rally these guys. Uh, these guys as well. I'm going to set them to moving up. But we're just trying to form up so I can counterattack. I also have that A, uh, triple A piece right there. Otherwise, I'm going to try to use my numbers to uh, overwhelm and attack. So meanwhile, blue four, uh, Falks. I'm not sure what happened to Falks. Why well, there's blood on the ground, but uh, that's weird. Maybe he accidentally ejected. <laughs> let's uh, let's get him a warm. All right, another missile went through, and the tank fired back. Looks like it missed. They got their SPG9 that's pushed up. They're taking shots at this tank. Another miss. Tank fires again. It's ejected the shell. Gun's still pointing downward. That time just completely missed. Surprise, these guys haven't engaged each other yet. Looks like they're using this uh, little hill down here as defilade cover. Oh, now they're engaging. Ground south, Rocket just went out. Swing and a miss. And that tank is now pushing up against them. Rocket, that was a D track kill. All right. Good. Meanwhile, these guys are getting hammered. Seymour's gone prone. Johnny's trying to engage. Quickly checking over on the tier 3 side. They've deployed. Ambiguous is staying low. They'll probably have to pick up Falks. But yep, they're going to drop a drone and move into the AO. Alright. I gotta keep an Actually, eye out for Pogo. Blue uh, send traffic blue 4. Roger, can we get the TP for Pogo and Falks and heal for Falks? What happened to Falks? He, uh, had some technical difficulties with the topper. What does that mean? Uh, he, he fell out of the chopper. <laughs> I want him to say it. I'll give you Pogo, but if you fall out of a chopper, that's your own doing. No, he's speaking on 55, he's on 55 short range views at the ultimate north edge of the map. Just saying, if you, if you scroll wheel eject, that's your own fault. Alright, Jesus, these guys, I'm gonna have a large counter attack go in. Try to send them to uh, go around and secure a large infantry push. This will be the main fight. Well, let's also send some over. Roger, Alpha be advised. I'm seeing multiple hostile infantry right outside of your building. Hostiles are holding in the red building. We're grouping now. We're gonna push out soon. I mean, it's not like like they could take that, roll it up, open the door, and annihilate the infantry if they wanted to. Let's see, what else do I have operating over That's here? Tough. I do have that Dushka. They're also provide, uh, providing rear security here and shooting whoever comes through. Let's yeah, they've got that door up, shut. Shall we? Just trying to have them swarm the building. My other fear is this uh, AAA gun. Well, that sucks. It's fine. Oh, that would be an RPG gunner. He's broken through the infantry lines and he just fired. He got the uh, 
Wow, he walked away. That's rare. But yeah, they lost their dish gun. The other dish gun's moving around. Watch out, look at this above. Currently holding the red building. These guys, uh, I wouldn't suppress casualties. that because it has all of our vehicles in it. We're trying to secure it. Or at least re-secure it. That's no buffer. So I guess Ambiguous has picked him up. Alright. So far, so good. So, we've blown up one of their assets, but everything okay. else has been okay. It's just the infantry kind of overextended from the vehicles, and that's why that issue happened. Now we have this Dishka right here. KTD is literally walking right on top of it. Your hostile infantry squad to north. Hearing a Euro so moving. Done. Are they trying to barricade the doors now to provide more cover? <laughs> Ground command to high command. This is high command, on traffic. And there goes KTD from that Dishka, because again, they overextended. So he's not going to be replying to me anytime soon. I'm keeping uh, this group over here in reserve right now. And meanwhile, Ambiguous is bringing Falks over. They'll get redeployed and they'll start on their objectives. Again, you know, for five people, this will be difficult, I will say, because we do have the Dishka to worry about. We've got these uh, roaming infantry, but I have cut the grass. So let's uh, take a quick look at frame count right now. Good 40. That's, that's not bad. Uh, you got to consider I'm also streaming recording, so that bogs me down quite a bit to be at a computer similar to like a medium to lower end. So, you know, people with better end computers are probably getting up to 50. Good stuff. Good stuff. But uh, Blue 4 will start engaging those AOs. Uh, the UN, they've... Uh, they're off. They're commanding officers down because he was running out by himself and then the vehicles are kind of out of position here. They're schwacking what they can. We got infantry cutting around here and shooting, uh, taking pot shots over at this place. Yes, man. Face to fight. So I'm gonna have this guy uh, seek and destroy, go for those vehicles since he does have RPGs. Okay, don't don't Ground phase into that. Stop phasing into that damn thing. Okay, they're going to blow this uh, depot, uh, this thing up. But their ground command is down at this time. Thankfully, uh, the vehicles took care of that dish, because otherwise these guys uh, could have run into a similar fate. Let's see, and that guy's down. I'm trying to think. I do have this two-man team to send in for reinforcing purposes. Uh, I might so just help we're going to fall in. back real quick, regroup, and then we're going to push back in. Yeah, so Lord is uh, pushing up to KTD's position. He looks to be a bit crippled himself. He uh, did he get Lord blown up, up uh, in that we vehicle. Need medic. He's a pack. But they're going to have to have Seymour uh, take care of both of them. Solid. Otherwise, they're pushing their vehicle up a bit. But yeah, that's always the risk when you send the infantry way ahead of the vehicles. Because if you're able, if they're you know caught in a position and they get cut off from an infantry swarm, and if that infantry swarm has a shot on your vehicles, then your vehicles are kind of fucked. Also, if you need me, uh, I am also a viable extract vehicle. Alright, so they put their drone way uh, up I'm and they're using that the to recon. Just in case you need me. Uh, they got five people down. Just in case you need quick. But yeah, you know, away. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 14 infantry here with one to extract, so 15, and then two two-man, same deal. It's literally cut and paste, but different territories. So I, I have enough faith in them to uh, be able to handle that sort of operating area. Here's what I will do, though, because this is starting to linger a bit. I'm going to go into my reinforcements tab. Uh, make a new land uh, LZ over here, landing zone. I'm uh, Actually, that's next to a house. I want somewhere that can branch off a bit. So I'm going to go for uh, about right here. Rally point wise, I'm going to send it directly to him, and I'm going to bring in a single infantry team of uh, Chekadee to come in and reinforce, because they've been dilly-dallying a bit. This is letting the commanders, uh, who I'm acting as, that the uh, Blue Force guys are going to capture, uh, you know, to let them try to regroup some guys and uh, send units in. So we're going to go with uh, some trucks here. 
go with some uh, simple urls and we're going to do some uh, full teams so there we go it should be noted that as soon as in terms of the operating purposes as soon as the uh both officers are taken i won't be reinforcing my ao anymore because uh that's my leadership gone but until then, I'm going to start light and then throw in a bit more and bit more. Got to consider that the biggest asset they have, their stepping stone, their Achilles heel is a BMP2, which is limited and on its own. I was hoping they'd at least get a pilot on tonight, but we do have a lot of people playing post-scriptum right now. Uh, those are mainly our twos and above, which nothing wrong with that. Just we got to consider, you know, our numbers for the player base and what's balanced for them. So charge went off. So... And there it goes. Alright, so they blew up an enemy ammo cache, but it didn't, uh, have anything. Uh, vehicle. Didn't oh, yeah, blow up. Yeah, so this uh, AAA gun is kind of in cover with the hose back here. But, ooh, that's loud. Sounds like that vehicle is also firing on some stragglers. And we'll get that off. Checking on Blue 4 again. They're moving their lines accordingly. And here come my reinforcements. Fucking secure the town for now. So okay, this is the infantry that has the, you know, two sets of AT, the single fire, and uh, the actual dedicated RPG gunner. You, stop. They can't see you right now, so please stop being suicidal. Oh my god. Fucking retard. I'll send him back there and delete him since there's no air assets to uh, watch anyway. Let's me get away with a little uh, more. Oh, you poor bastards. Currently searching buildings. Triple A just took to Mr. J's point. head off. Hey, fam. Try the back in this one, yes, sir. Triple A's turning um, back. I'm for those, uh, food park trucks. Ah, that got... That's gonna... It's <laughs> gonna need some aspirin for that one. Ooh. The medics are still back here, covering each other. Is it the mobile thingy or the third one? Have the infantry coming in. I'm gonna give them a seek and destroy marker. Understood. And my fear right now is at this flank, the AT infantry are gonna be able to get up to here and possibly pop that BMP off before they realize that they're being outflanked. And they're pulling up even more in the open right now. No one's covering the left. Because we have all these infantry right here, no one's securing that other flank because they're growing complacent that there can't be anything to their left. But there clearly is movement across these open fields, there's now gunfire. Grenade even goes off on that BMP, so he's going to immediately back up. Alpha B5, shot five to yourself. Now I'm going to pop some smoke Solid grenades. Game, yeah. One of them has their, uh, that, uh, single fire AT launcher out. He gets taken out. I wonder if their, uh, RPG gunner is down as well. Nope, he's still up back here. Yep, he's taking that puppy out. He's blind firing it through the smoke. <laughs> that should make him fuck right back off. Yep, they stopped because now the smoke's in the way because that was to save them. Now, if they were smart and the AI would listen to my commands, I'd actually order them to pull back and swing it around, but since they're already engaged in the combat, they're not going to bother. Now, this puppy's fl uh, firing blindly through the smoke here. Now they're all starting to uh, disengage around. Let's, uh, let's get, get popped. All right, meanwhile, okay, Blue 4 have almost me, made uh, it to their position. They're picking in between areas, so uh, I can't minute. tell which one they're going to go me. for first. A fucking ball for what? Yeah, that AT guy's still alive. 
but it looks like they uh, pulled Jay back. Yep, they're dragging him back right now from the tree. All right, so this guy, he's the gunner. I'm going to have him switch over to the gunner's seat. I mean, the AI skill of reinforcements is 50 across the board. It's just its general skill is a little weaker, but when you already have them dictated on a path, it doesn't really matter. Um, just their accuracy goes a bit up. But they still miss the rocket shot, so it doesn't really matter to me. Let's, uh, let's give them a warm welcome, shall we? Yeah, so we have a few guys knocked unconscious. Some of uh, the VPY AKs. Now, with that BMP in mind, uh, I think we're going to deploy... My next act would be a dedicated AT team. So, two AT pairs put together. And I'm going to send these guys back here and keep them on reserve. I've got all this stuff over here to send. But that BMP, too, is my priority to uh, mess with. Send in go to team six now. Weirded out. Thanks so much for the sub, man. Hope you uh, enjoy the operations. I hope you continue to enjoy this one, man. Thanks so much. Yeah, how often do the AI even listen to a Zeus? Especially if you have mods like VCOM AI or ASR AI 3 loaded, which uh, make the AI more Is independent. You need to tell me really? Ay, ay, ay. There's a reason you see me sometimes quickly delete and repaste AI. It's because they're just, they become so stupid. So they shot uh, that guy. That guy's bleeding. He's dead. Delete some of the bodies back there, and they're just slowly uh, breaching and clearing. That is a weird garrison position. I'm just going to kill him off. Yeah, so it's reading this as debris, but this is what it actually does? Uh -huh. Did it just launch his butt? Okay, 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 um, I'm not gonna question that, I'm just gonna just pretend that never happened, and, uh, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll counter-attack the player base in a moment, just, um, what the fuck was that? That was a fancy little break dance if I've ever seen one, but, uh, yeah, that was also creepy as hell. So I'm also going to call in another uh, reinforcing wave to come in, spawn. We'll do the same exact thing again. Hopefully the fucking truck will obey There's my no command. Alpha. There's only command spawn and alpha. Send traffic. Ay, ay, ay. Looks like these guys are going for the closer one first to alleviate uh, any possible green, uh, green on blue. Be patient. All right. Times table wise, they're going a bit slower than I want them to. But it's also because I thought there'd be a little bit more tier twos playing today. Yeah, no, both of you would probably break away and run and pop a smoke grenade because that thing's trying to kill you. And you got cut in that fucking building right there, so I'm just gonna repaste you. Here, I'll have you group up with uh, that infantry team and you can reassault. Ground south, so we've cleared up the west side. Uh, or correction, southwest side, uh, we're moving north. So with those two guys. That guy's still unconscious, he's dead. I don't think any of you have AT, so you wouldn't want to fuck with that BMB, but you'd probably mention that it's, like, right there. So, yeah, get the fuck down. Here, we'll have you two regroup with him. And then radioing with this team, they would counterattack. 
So we would do that and then have this one come over here and we'll replace the uh, global AI skill because why not? Now, is that truck actually pulling back? Yes, it is. Perfect. How are the blue four peeps doing? This is that priority target because Adishka could easily fuck them all up. So I think they're starting to uh, come close. Uh, they're going to prioritize taking out that Dishka first in that sentry, and then there's just, uh, you know, some intermediate infantry for them to worry about. So some of them are starting to get sighted. Have some infantry starting to cross over as well. And what, are they, like, looting the dead bodies for better... <laughs> for different guns? Fucking hell. So an RPG just went off, now it's using its auto cannon. Half a B5 is once you're ready, you're quick to push into a jet of platform. And they are opening fire back and forth, so. Yeah, that is not the direction I wanted you to go into, guys. I wanted you to like come in. It's not here to be engaged. RPG just will flew right over their heads. So yeah, now they're gonna pull back. Well, so much for that little guard tower. If one guy with an AK can just annihilate that position. <laughs> that BMP is backing up with uh, the SPG-9. And you all just got fucked. Idiots. All of my AI are idiots. So yeah, now they're using this, uh, oh, okay, so they demoed that. I'll cook the, uh, Ural off as well. They're using the husk of a BTR to, uh, eliminate the players. So this Dishka, he wants to go on his own, which he wants to be slowly driving. I guess I might as hell send him up as a scout unit. Anyway, Blue 4 have already begun their assault. So I'm going to send this group over. Actually, they're not even aggroed. Never mind. Yeah, these guys that are part of the squad are going to be aggroed, but until there's actual, you know, herd gunshots and these guys react. All right, so that is enough to bring this group over to come check out what's going on. Uh, I think we can assume that the... So, uh, hold on. AI... Damn. You just got armored by the building. Uh, hold on. Alpha B5, once you're ready, push into Bafo. Yeah, yeah. You sure you didn't get shot, my friend? So we're starting to have those things come in. I'm going to send, let's see, reinforcing wise, they've got their, they've got their target. Uh, reinforcing wise though, I'm going to uh, create a new LZ up here, create a new rally point, and then spawn units I'm going to bring from the edge of the map right here. Uh, team of eight to come check out what's going on. So that'll start coming up. Uh, I'm going to affirmative. Also, ungarrison this group of AI and have them come over to this building so you can destroy wise. Hi, command. The hostage was an exceptionally weak man. Got shot through my body and instantly died. Proceeding to second hostage. Solid copy, Blue 4, that's unfortunate. Out. Got shot through his body. He was fine a second ago. What shot him? Huh. That's weird. But hey, sometimes that happens. That's part of the op. So this BTR is pushed up. No one's down from it yet. Nope, Seymour, the medic is down. Ground, None of these guys have AT. Oh, that's down. not... That's not good. Be no 
Yeah, so it's just suppressing the infantry. They don't have any infantry-based AT. That's not good. I I gave each squad a freaking AT gunner with a saw and an assistant. So they just popped the damn medicine to that damn thing. Brown, we're gonna need the Lord our medic went down. He found we should be yeah, right to you. So I will send these guys over to reinforce. Yeah, I'll really on and it. I will adjust my rally point over here for when so. they begin their other assaults. So anyway, uh, this car should still be coming, and you got yourself stuck. Okay. Interesting. Blue 4, this is High Command, you copy? Hey, yeah, everyone, copy. Roger, uh, I've gotten some more patchwork intel from the UN. They're apparently looking for uh, food and water trucks. If you run into any, uh, try not to touch them. Roger that. And then let me know. I'll uh, I'll give a good word to the UN on some intel on where they are. So I have these guys basically coming over. Again, like, they're doing a wide flank, which is annoying as hell, so I usually just do this. Tell them all to seek and destroy, have them come in manually. The only issue with this is that, like, you know, adds to the server load as them all behaving as individual units, but at least they take a more direct route, or I guess they're just gonna fucking veer right instead of going direct, idiots. They're all idiots. <laughs> Silly AI. This is also something I'm a bit worried about. That AA piece. They're checking bodies probably for additional supplies. Send goat team six now. Otherwise they're medicating each other up where they can and that BMP is watching down that main road. And they've got uh, the Ural back here. Uh... I guess this guy's uh, getting rid of some stress. Because uh, there's there's nothing over there. <laughs> Let me spawn a smoke grenade right here. Be advised, uh, we had infantry retreating from the compound stays southwest of the town. Pop a few smoke grenades. Daniel, thanks so much for the resub, man. I hope you're enjoying uh, everything here, and I uh, hope you keep enjoying the ops in the future, man. Thanks so much. Uh, the face rig, I use it for drunk streams and stuff, because um, it, it takes too much CPU power, so, so when you put it with Arma, right. it really looks fucked up. <laughs> really fucked up. So, so we got an intermediate infantry squad with them. Josh Hoyes. It's more the body. Yeah, we'll keep following the road, clear away for uh, Andrews. How's Blue 4 doing? They're uh, Be advised, we only have one approaching that and ambiguous left. is on standby. Uh, can we go back? At, do we have time to do a quick r and You might as well do that. So they want to pull back with the BMP2 to, to rearm it. But it might not be the best idea because this AO is only going to be tougher. Honest, it's doing a lot of the work. All right, you idiots, let's pull back you guys as survivors, cause your AT is done. Let's see if I can swing you around with uh, that guy. Yeah, yes, the priest of pie, whatever the fuck that means. All right, so these guys are uh, setting up right here. Probably still checking with the drone. I do have some guys, you know, on high places that could easily outflank them if they're not careful. But coming from that vector, they might not see them. Hopefully the drone will, though. It possibly could, depend on its angle. But yeah, that, uh, that dish goes the priority, because that can actually seriously hurt people. Back to the uh, Tier 2 operation with the UN. So they're pushing forward, uh, all they've got are their vehicles coming up, that BMP is barreling back. 
So they still have AT capability with his SPG-9. And this guy, I... I don't know why he's just firing his rifle. I really don't understand it. But yeah, so uh, let's let these three... They're gonna follow their waypoints to a T, so I'm gonna do this. But yeah, this, uh, this ZSU is going to be very difficult to eliminate. Mainly because I didn't see any of the players with AT. None of them picked that role. Yeah, so correction, this ZSU is going to be impossible to kill unless they get lucky with the SPG-9 shot. So, yeah, this, this is going to be a mess. We got some guys on this uh, battle tower. They're firing out through the trees. They're popping smoke grenades as well. But I'm going to keep that ZSU stationary until I absolutely need it. Meanwhile, Blue 4 have begun their assault. There are gunshots, so I'm going to maneuver them around. Bogo just took a shot. Looks like his helmet took it because he didn't go down. They're firing back and forth here. This Dishka doesn't want to react. Yeah, so this rifleman up here is the one firing down on him. Yeah, so Bogo got knocked unconscious. We got this guy right here in the corner firing. Ruling drops him. And Yander's also uh, taking position right there. They can hear that dish uh, car no, moving no, around. Sounds like the UN found their ZSU. Valk's is trying to take out that dish car. Okay, they knocked him out. Two casualties. ZSU might be down. ZSU's down. We're moving it now. Stay fine. I don't want. I try to minimize the turret glitch where they're knocked unconscious, but they still use the damn turret. So anyway, gunfire. It's going to attract these guys to come check out what the hell is going on. Set them to seek and destroy, full, move back ASAP. But they've got their one HVT and they will react with them accordingly. I'm going to send this BMV-1 over to provide assistance. As well as uh, that two-man infantry team. So ZSU got cooked off. That SVG-9 did manage to hit them in time. Yeah, okay, yeah, no, teacher's the AA guy. Why did I just play my fucking radio? I will never know. Uh, BMPs, we on, we are returning back now to the air. Okay, so we got this reinforcements in play. Let me, uh... Wait, no, I'm captured yeah, right now. I can't reinforce. Anything northwest but... of three. We haven't cleared the road out yet. Yeah, so they've got me... Understood in a car right now, and they've got Pogo, who's been knocked unconscious, right, and there's we'll no with this. Stand by just in case you need me. So yeah, we got the water Vic and the uh, ground Vic. Ground, we've found one times water truck so far. He found to kill it. Otherwise, they're pulling back, and you know, we'll have this light infantry force over here, just kind of reacting to where they were previously. But now I can't bring in any reinforcements. I can only utilize what is in the field. So I'll delete my reinforcing markers. I'm not going to delete the bodies at the previous two objectives, because that's going to add immersion to the fact that the UN force was already there. Otherwise, they're breaching and clearing. And it looks like the technical is also going in. Is that my AGS or my Dishka? That's my Dishka. Yeah, so this is just a light garrison over here. <clears throat> and otherwise, yeah, Blue 4 looks like they're driving back to their rendezvous point. And Ambiguous is back at base with the Black Hawk ready to go. I can be. Am I called in? If I, uh, it sounds like they're calling them. in, uh, because I'm probably far away from them, so I can't hear their short-range channel. Uh, they're gonna be calling their guys, uh, and whatnot. Alright, so I'm gonna give, uh, this Dishka truck's here, he gets shot dead. I'm gonna un-garrison. 
This command B5, hostile BMP, mark on map. It's remaining infantry. So I got my AT guy on now. Have them come out over here. Hey, hi, this is Blue 4. We did find one of those water trucks. It is at the further west objective marker. Grid 033067. There was also a food truck. Just stand me BMP down. Solid. Uh, thanks for the intel. Main piece neutralized. Crew dismounted. Vehicle Coco killed him. Good job. Once I see them, uh, that they've, uh, brought back, I'll, uh, I'll give them a debrief. I keep seeing them looting bodies. I'll have to ask them why. Looks like Mr. J got shot. And that BMP was also taken out somehow. Alright, so we still have that infantry group. And I got these guys kind of swarming around. These guys do not want to move, do they? I guess I'll send them on a patrol like that. But yeah, the real difficult thing about these ops is I'm trying to time it so that, you know, they'll... There's a ch big chance that Blue 4 and Green 4 will run into each other. Uh, so what I... What I failed to do this week was just that, but it's because I completely overestimated the amount of players on the Green 4 side. Specifically, I was hoping they'd have a chopper to, um... You know, basically hit any reinforcements so, okay. coming in like they normally do. So with the reinforcements coming in, that effectively slowed the advance of the UN forces, and I did nothing to counteract that with uh, Blue Four. This is Guan Command High Jump Map. This is High Command Center traffic. Uh, we found a fucking water truck and a food truck on objective buffers. Are you gonna send some security boys to come and take care of it? Or we gotta drive them back? Uh, negative. Uh, reassign two people to drive them back and continue on up. Okay. Why was that a questionable okay? I will... <laughs> That, that's your op. I told you you're going to have to drive him back. Is that... Was that not clear? <laughs> uh, what type of ops are we going to do hey, tomorrow? Yeah, to exactly. To okay. It's like, to I, I told you that you would do that. You didn't question it then. I don't know why you're questioning so, it now. Uh, when they come back, just tell them to take your fucking UAC or something like that. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, tomorrow's ops are... Um, I don't know what I'm going to do for tomorrow. It's going to be more Cherno-Russian stuff. That's more... Because the Cherno-Russian stuff isn't really a campaign, I don't really have anything planned for it. Hey, look at that. So they did re -kit a guy with AT after all. Or he was part of this vehicle. He's probably the gunner. Hey, just to be sure... Alpha can send the BMP to escort them. I'm gonna assign Blue for another task. Uh, I'm gonna have him take those and VIX and drop them off. Yeah, I'll have him drop them off right there. Alright. Blue 4, this is High Command, you copy? Hey, from we copy. Roger, can you give me a sit rep? Roger, we are currently returning to base. One of the two hostages is with us. It's all copy. It's unfortunate what happens to the other one, but shit happens. Uh, are you guys done for the day, or do you want me to give you an additional task? Yeah, no, we're good to do something else. Solid. So you mentioned there was one times food and one times water truck uh, at the previous AO. Yep. 
Do you, would you guys mind securing those two vehicles and then bringing it to the large parking lot at Grid Ref uh, 036077? Uh, it's a position outside of the insurgents' reach at this time. Yeah, one second. Solid. Because by the time they're doing that, that'll, you know, add to the interaction. And then if they clear that one, uh, I'm going to then retask them to go to uh, Hikola and wait for the VIX. So again, just measuring the overlap. But you also have to consider that um, Green 4 are going to kind of steamroll that. So what I'm going to do to alleviate that and make it more difficult is I'm going to artificially bump the skill. To everything at about 75%. Now, numbers-wise, that BMP could steamroll all of this. But the difficulty... I've noticed when I make things much more difficult in terms of the AI ability, uh, it definitely slows down the player base. So I'm just estimating times, you know, by the time Blue 4 redeploys, they will, uh, you know, get that done. Plus, I think hey, it would be cool uh, to have that uh, trade-off. This is uh, NATO pilot. Uh, this is high command on traffic, NATO pilot. Uh, is it possible to uh, get an AC till or uh, fries equipped uh, to the Blackhawk? Yeah, I can assign the module. However, I can't guarantee it'll work because we've had some weird glitches uh, you, in the past. If you uh, attach the module, it'll work. All right, modules attached. Thank you much. So they're gonna fast rope in there. Do be advised, uh, U.S., it's quite possible that the enemies might have uh, sent some QRF to the area uh, before you left, so be careful. Hey, Alpha, I can give you the briefing on this, this objective. Uh, do you right, see the purple so they have the vehicles the brought back, and this will let them bring up a new truck. It looks like they're going to pick an open... Send left. ...rather than one of the uh, technicals, like do the Dishka the they lost, but on the map. Yeah, I see it. Uh, once the boys are ready, push uh, throw the purple line, push into Charlie. So now they're gonna they come in here. Give us one mic and we'll push out. Okay. Now, when I tell them at the rendezvous point, I'll probably... I'm gonna break my rule about reinforcing, just to claim that this squad was always there. Alright, now begs the question, where are we going? Is that being addressed to me, high command, uh, ground? Uh, negative. Whoop. So I'm going to, uh, in order to stall the player base, the UN player base, a bit more, I'm going to have a patrol right here. And another patrol over here. Is that one too far inland? Nah, it follows the road. So it should be okay. And these guys have AT equipped, so they're still a threat to fudge faces, right? No, they don't. Oh, yes, they do. They've got a single stick. That'll tickle the BMP or crit it one way or the other. Nope. All right, that's fine. All right, ground alpha. We're moving out now. So final objectives here. <laughs> they put him in a box. <laughs> hey, from Alpha. All right, it's not a joke saying they're going to cast strike me. So just in case they decide to make good on their death threat. <laughs> And now they're essentially moving out. Uh, oh, this glitch. The big teleportero el disappiro por favorio. 
I don't know. That's that's a weird glitch I've seen ever since an update before the tanks DLC. People have told me it's happened all the time, but I've seen it much more often Send recently. Go team six. Who the hell no. knows? Hey, Kamazar, thanks so much for the two month resub, man. I hope you keep enjoying the operations, and I hope you continue to keep enjoying the ops, man. Thanks so much. So they're now moving on from this AO, so I'm going to take care of these bodies. Here comes. Cool. And they'll just be pushing in. I've just got two sentries and another uh, garrison group. So Ambiguous is coming in. Looks like they're going to fast rope in. So a quick touchdown here. Player base gets out. Only four. No, there's the fifth. All right. I thought they were going to keep a chopper gunner on. But I wonder. Nah, that's too far out of audio range. Random segment of road right here. Oh, it's, a, it's supposed to be a little footbridge. All right, so that block hawks here. Since you guys are taking the trucks, you won't need an extra railway. Have that RTB. But they just told an RTB. Surprised none of them are turning, shooting fucking small arms at it to make it wave off. Yeah, otherwise these guys taking their sweet sweet time. I might have to break my reinforcing rule to uh, make things a bit longer. So, what I can do is that since we're foregoing those two operations. Pogo just went down. Yander takes that guy out. Ruling's working on him. These guys are still up. Send these guys out and about to outflank them. Whew, they mowed him the fuck down. Uh oh. So, ruling left out and about back here. He gets hit by this guy. Wakes back up though. Rolls to try to line up a shot on him. He's already getting fired at. This guy fucking mag dumped to the side of that. And then with the pistol combo, Viander and uh, Ruling's rifle, they take that guy out. Oh, and this auto rifleman right here. He's quickly taken out. Alright, so that's secured. Gonna try to send these guys up. Yeah, one mistake is all it takes. Those guys have eliminated that two-man group. And I can send that other patrol. Then again, I don't need to stall them right now. So what I am going to do instead... Bring the timetable up. Bring them around. This command be advised. I spotted a food truck and a water truck in Objective Charlie. Let's see if I can get that going. So they can apparently see the vehicles in here. Yeah, through that little slit, they can see both of those. That makes sense. So they're taking a high amount of fire. I got these guys pushing in. I'll vary them up a bit. I think they're still giving Pogo some medical. Uh, they're loaded up in the AGS. They took the BM-21 as well. I think they're grouping them together or something. That'd be funny. But yeah, so now we just have the reinforcements going in. Break those four apart, send them in as well. Command to BMP B5, watching fire. Watching fire, I think. Trying to these guys to come in. 
And then I'm going to deselect all of them, regroup them, and have these guys on garrison and provide a flanking force over here to try to sandwich uh, this group with uh, these guys. So again, none of these guys have a... Well, no, they have a single AT stick that they could use. Contact north, north, north. And so calling that contact. These idiots won't get out. So, you know, reassign them accordingly. Where's coming from your west -ish. And these two are starting to come up to breach and clear. Um, plus, north west, plus kind of like plus. Send left rail. Ah, uh, ye old out flank. What? So you ignored him and you went up to shoot him right into... What the fuck did I just witness? Motherfuckers. God damn it. So they're still taking care of Pogo. Pogo's back up. So it looks like they're going to, uh, with five people, take the water, food, the BMP, the BM-21 and that AGS and uh, go out. Looks like they killed the other two guys that were reinforcing... Why aren't you standing? Have you been crawling that entire... You're an idiot. Alright, so they are redeploying now and moving to that last position. Alright. So yeah, they got those last two vehicles secured. They're probably medicking themselves though because they took quite a few shots. That body armor... Must be some really good shit to be tanking 762 like that. Yeah, I'm seeing a lot of people looting bodies here. Well, there goes that last guy. Ground Command UN, this is High Command, you copy? We're currently extracting with a food, a water Stand truck, by. and AGS-30 U.S. and a BM-21. Saw a copy, well done. Perfect. UN forces, if you have two people to spare, I'd like you to get in a car, uh, scratch that three people, uh, and send them to Gridref 036077, the town of Hecola. Uh, we're gonna be doing a handoff, uh, again, Zero three six zero seven seven. Can you mark him on the map? Hi, man. I don't. What? Can you mark it on? Okay, someone mark it. Uh, what are we doing? Want me to pick there? up there? Send up three. You want me to wipe your handle. ass for you too? Like, what else what do you, do you want? Off? Copy that. Can this landing probably won't be as exciting as the last one. Oh, what the hell? Yeah, so they just took a wrong turn. Uh, don't know where they're going with that. So I was thinking like they could take that off road or something. But yeah, then we'll have that interaction, then boom, uh, we'll have everything go through. Uh, Clown Command to High Command about uh, whatever the fuck thing is. I'm sending three people over there. Saw so a copy. Blue Four, this is High Command. Uh, I'd like you to hold position with those assets uh, until UN forces come in to relieve uh, them, just in case any insurgents were tracking you. Confirm, sit here and defend the assets. Go to Alpha, can you sit well? We scared one time. A firm. Yeah, yeah, correction, water truck, then one time, food truck. 
Oh wait, same deal, send two guys, uh, send two guys, drive them back to the base and BMP will escort. Uh, escort? Yeah. Uh, UN forces, this is High Command. Be advised, uh, there will be blue four units on site at the uh, handoff points. Uh, do not blue on blue. Now, what the fuck are you doing, actually? Sorry. Say again. Like High High Command, what are you doing? Actually. Roger, Blue 4 were conducting operations in the AO and they ran into one times water and one times food truck and relayed that intel to me. Uh, I politely asked them to if they could secure that for us since that is within our directive. So right now you're sending a few guys to go pick it up from the Blue 4 units. Do you copy? Okay. KTD, man, I'm gonna freaking so rattle your neck. All free food and water truck. Do you want us to RTB? Hey, firm, you can RTB at this time. Alright, Alpha, you're returning to base. Rain his little neck in. Ground yeah, I'm gonna have these guys come up. Affirmative. Pogo's just going in his house. He's done. You know, the insurgents are going to be attracted from that, uh, by that helicopter. Yep, so there's some gunfire. Going to uh, teleport myself in. Where's the hide Zeus button? Dig on your trench. All right, yeah, they're taking. That's something they Someone can't change. Someone throw a guys, 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 <coughs> Turned up. Dig trenches for defensive. Why do you have the same picture as mine? Blue team has reached uh, straight off, dropped off to Diamond Fragos. takes forever. <laughs> He's gotta go get the fucking water truck. Oi, idiot in the car. It helps not to be in front of the bullets. <laughs> no, command, this is blue for the UN has picked up the food and water truck. Solid. Uh, all blue four units, RTB at this time. I say again, RTB at this time. Roger, uh, do you have any specific orders for the captured assets? Uh, negative. Uh, if you can, uh, demo, otherwise, I guess take it back if it's uh, close enough. Otherwise, demo. So just convoying back with what, all the captured shit? <laughs> Fair enough. All right. So again, uh, I'm not going to be able to do the Kadal operation. Something IRL came up, uh, and I have to uh, take care of that. But uh, how things are going to be run in the future is we'll be doing this, and then we'll switch gears to Kadal and uh, do that. And uh, this will be Tier 2 operations doing UN stuff, and then Tier 3 and 4 as Blue 4, and then Tier 3 guys are running Kadal. And then uh, Tier 4, the special... Uh, Excuse me, like the special forces that uh, run to that. So, yeah.
Uh, but that was uh, that was overall a good operation. We saw some flaws. We saw the player base recover from it, but it did cost them a few times. Uh, nothing that was game changing uh, that they couldn't recover from, but it definitely threw them under a loop. It just the initial tactic right here was uh, pretty subpar. Because once again, it was the infantry breaking too far away from the vehicles and possibly getting outflanked. And if I was, uh, if I had some, you know, competent AI, you know, set to higher difficulty than the standard tier 2, it would have been much more devastating. But otherwise, the rest of the blue force being extracted. And I think this is a really good op concept that we're, um, that we'll be pursuing. There they go, they just uh, demoed the AGS Vic. And he's, he's using the edge of the map to bring the truck back. It's cute. Alright, Blue 4, well done. We'll be uh, ending the server in 30 seconds. For that. All right, uh, UN forces, well done. We'll be ending the server in about 20 seconds. So yeah, it was good. Still needs a bit of uh, work Yo, and rebalance. Get a cast track on the Maka? Yo, can I get a number five, a number seven large? Uh, uh, da, 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 da. Goes up to hit the tree. <laughs> he went for the car. <laughs> All right. I'm home. I can restart. All right. So overall, that was uh, that was pretty good. Uh, just uh, you know, we have a bit of a lower player count this week. Uh, it's because most of the guys are also, you know, getting into postscriptum because of that test server. Uh, the testing weekend is this weekend, so uh, I had to cut a few corners there because uh, I geared it for you know a few more guys to show up. But that's fine. Uh, either way, uh, things were well done. Uh, on the tier, th uh, tier three blue force side, uh, I've got no feedback. Uh, there was only one instance where you were medicing a guy out in the open, and he got out flank and shot, but he then woke up and took care of contact, so just be mindful of your flanks. Uh, and then Tier 2, uh, make sure you don't push your infantry too far ahead of the vehicles. Uh, you lost your Dushka truck because that's exactly what you did, and then AT infantry came around and started taking pot shots at your Vix. Um, this was our standard Tier 2 difficulty that I'm seriously consider upping the difficulty in slight niches to uh, what we had last week and the week before, because you guys can handle it, but there was a good, like, 8 or 9 RPGs fired at your BMP too, so just keep that in mind. Uh, other than that, things were well done, and, uh, yeah, tactics were well done, so I've got, uh, nothing to say on my end. Uh, Blue 4, you got anything to say? Um, um, the only the, thing. Why is the AI right. double tapping? It's hmm? the new Ace thing. It's been the new Ace update for a year, basically. When you're when you go down, you're no longer marked a civilian. It's just your body is more hidden. Well, that's so yeah. annoying. Die, yeah, it's been a thing for like four months now. Yeah, ever um, since Ace went from uh, modules to Ace options, so yeah, four or five months. Next. That's just stupid. So the only thing I noticed, um. Because of the way the friendly settings were, uh, I don't know if they ever knew or if they ever had the idea of looking oh, at it, it but uh, they could see our helmet cams. And they could see us on C-Tab. I know where you guys are. Yeah, so uh, that's that's the same thing with the radios in the future. Um, since this was the test run for it, I'll set you both to uh, hostile from each other, so that won't be the case. Uh, yeah. Even though I said it in um, using Achilles commands, it didn't actually make all the mod switch, uh, mod switches happen. So that'll be fixed for next time. Don't you worry. Okay. All right. Nothing else from Boo Four. Um, KTD. Anything to say from UN? Uh, fifteen cows fun. Getting shot in the face. Don't do that. Nah, nah nothing. Blue on blue, green on blue, no, I understand that. 
All right, well, um, like I said, because it's some IRL shit, this is the only thing I'm going to be uh, Zeusing today, so my apologies. Uh, in the future, it'll be uh, something like this that'll take anywhere from an hour to an hour and a half. This took about an hour and a half, so good on the time. Uh, and then Kidal would be like two 30, 45 minute missions. So, uh, warm about 10 to 15, you know, set up in RTB, and then 30 of actual gameplay time. So, uh, hopefully, with Sniper Wolf, he's coming back this week, right? Ambi, Ander, you know that? Yep. Yeah. yeah. All right. So, hopefully, with him coming back this week, we can then uh, implement the tier four shift and, uh, you know, brief everyone on how that will work, and, uh, you know, everything will go from there. So, thank you guys for playing today. And uh, enjoy the rest of your day. And if you have postscriptum, definitely go play that because we're uh, getting the server up soon. So, yay. Cheers. Sadly, I can't. Every time I try and join a server, it kicks me. So, ouch. Yay. Anyway, BRB. And to the stream, thank you so much for checking this out. Sorry we're cutting today short, but um, Bay takes priority. <laughs> but anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Go operate operationally. Enjoy the rest of your Sunday. Take care and have a good one.